Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, well, um, just to uh, recap, some of you have been asking about uh, what was in there. The uh, Windows uh, C updates for the bug fixes, so Windows 10 and Windows 11 21 each 2 had received them the week before, but it took a more than a week after to get the updates for 22 H2. So on January the 26th, that's last Thursday, late in the day, there was release of uh, the uh, bug fixing updates for Windows 11 22H2. So that is all the updates for the month. So we had, of course, the patch Tuesday, and now the uh, updates for the bug fixes are for every version of Windows available. So in Windows 11 22H2, if you look at your update history, if you already have it installed, if not, it's going to be there. It's going to say that it's an optional download and install. Optional is a big word as it will install itself when you actually get the patch Tuesday updates. So um, 502.2360 was released for um, Windows 11 22H2. And it's just interesting to see that um, I did get the uh, 402.3057 uh, update, which was on Windows 10, the one that is showing multiple times in Windows everywhere. Uh, seems to be related mostly to a fixing of Windows Update itself. So it's kind of a maintaining update or something. And there was, in my case, a .NET Framework update also. Uh, so what did this update bring to the Windows uh, operating system for 22H2? If we look at the highlights of what it brought, uh, one is the search indexer that uh, was aff affected by a problem that is fixed addresses um, conflict uh, between two or more threads or known as a deadlock and some of the resources and uh, also an issue that affects picture files when you're using a search on the taskbar. So these are some of the highlights, but there's a big list. A lot of it is the same list of the previous updates. So if you had some problems with Windows 11 22H2, maybe you want to check it out and see what um, it fixes. Maybe it's going to fix your problems. If you've got no issues, honestly, what you could do is just leave it alone. And it will anyways install itself when uh, Patch Tuesday arrives in February. So uh, it's up to you to decide what you want to do. So the bug fixing update has finally been released. And a lot of you might not have seen it because they might have just um, uh, stayed in there as optional updates and not installed. So you haven't seen any update or anything showing an update uh, before I talked about it today. It's, it's totally possible you haven't seen anything, but it's just there waiting. So uh, <coughs> if you've got, sorry, if you've got a problem, uh, just uh, make sure that you update your system and uh, you will be uh, up to date for the security fixes. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching my videos.